Charlie Adam has hailed Andy Robertson for becoming a success at Liverpool and explained how his fellow Scott succeeded where he failed at Anfield. Both men were signed by Liverpool from clubs relegated from the Premier League. Adam joined from Blackpool for £7 million in 2011, and Robertson arrived in an £8 million deal from Hull in 2017. Adam struggled at Anfield before leaving the club when Brendan Rodgers replaced Kenny Dalglish a year later, but Robertson has become an unexpected hit, establishing himself as one of Europe's best left-backs after a slow start to life at Liverpool. Adam believes that Jurgen Klopp's decision to allow Robertson to bet in slowly helped the current Scotland captain settle at Anfield, whereas his own introduction to the team was a little too rapid. He told the Scotsman it's hard when you come from a team that's been relegated. I did it as well from Blackpool. When I went, Stevie Gerrard was injured along with a few others, so my opportunity came quite quick, but they were in a transition period. If Stevie or Lucas had been fit, I'd have been in the same situation Andy was and might not have played because I came from Blackpool. Jurgen Klopp had him on the sidelines, but he did well in training, got his chance, and has never looked back. He's been the best left back in the league, probably the best left back in the Champions League as well. He's proof that it's not where you start your career that matters, it's where you finish. Video loading video on available click to play tap to play the video will start an 8 cancel play now, if Liverpool won the league, he'd be a cult hero. The players love him, the fans love him, Liverpool have always had a tradition of Scottish players, and the one thing they always love about them is how hard they work. We have the most endeavor, we want to win, we have a passion and they've related to him in that way. But don't forget he's also a quality player. His assists, the link-up play he has with Sadio Mane is fantastic. Although it took him three or four months to get the opportunity, he hasn't been out of the team since. Meanwhile, Adam insists he tried to convince Stoke to sign Robertson when Hull were relegated. He added, I said to Stoke at the time we should have bought him for £8 million, it was cheap. Liverpool could afford to throw that at him though, and if it hadn't worked it wouldn't have been a gamble for them. What's that £8 million worth now? Put a 5 in front of it at least, it's probably £60 million, £70 million for a left back.